Millions of people will be flying over the holidays, so listen up. Danger may be hiding in plain sight right in your luggage. Lithium ion batteries inside your tablet, laptop, or phone, even your electronic toothbrush can be flammable when they're damaged or they overheat. The FAA says that they're causing more fires on planes than ever before. Our national consumer correspondent, Usher Qureshi, reports on efforts to make passengers more aware of the risks. Go forward! Go forward! Do not take your back! Go forward! Panic in the aisle of an American Airlines flight from San Francisco to Miami. It was absolute chaos. It truly felt like every man for themselves. And it was terrifying. Shilpa Patel just sat down when smoke filled the cabin. I don't know if we're going to explode. All I know is I need to get out and I need to survive. Were you scared for your life? I was. What do you do when there's a fire on the plane? You're trapped there. Where do you go? Passengers had to evacuate after a laptop battery inside a carry-on bag spontaneously caught fire. FAA data shows lithium battery fires are up 388% on U.S. flights since 2015. Now on average happening nearly twice a week. Two fires a week is a lot. It is, and any fire at 30,000 feet is, is unacceptable. David Roth is with the safety advocacy and research organization UL. Could one of these fires potentially take down a plane? That is a possibility. In a new survey of more than 800 flight attendants, UL found 87% are concerned about lithium batteries on airplanes. More than a third say airlines should do more to ensure battery safety. While the FAA requires airlines to include safety information and pre-flight announcements, that does not include the risk of battery fires. Some airlines, including American, Delta, and United, do offer some guidance about handling your devices. If you lose your phone or other device under a seat, ask a flight attendant to help find it. But they give no details about the risk of fire. Why not include more information about what to do in case of a lithium-ion battery fire in that pre-flight announcement? That, that's a great suggestion. Ben Supko oversees hazmat safety for the FAA. It's a balance that we we probably need to do a better job striking with the airlines, with the messaging we put out. Do you think passengers understand how serious the risk is? I don't think so. Passengers should never put a lithium battery in a checked bag, and they're warned about that during check-in. But it's also important to keep an eye on your devices in flight. If you notice something that's, that's getting warm to the touch, or the screen is discoloring, or it's starting to bulge, quickly notify flight crew and, and ensure that, it, that they come and, and address it immediately. <laughs> and prevent situations like this. It costs us pretty much nothing just to say, hey, the reason why we're so serious about this is because it could be really dangerous. It could catch fire, so you have to be careful. The UL survey also found one in four passengers admit to packing lithium batteries in their checked luggage, a dangerous practice since it would be even harder to put out a fire in the plane's cargo hold. Usher Qureshi, CBS News. And we asked American Airlines about the inf incident at the San Francisco airport you saw and if it has any plans to update its safety announcements. A spokesperson didn't answer that question but said flight attendants undergo rigorous and regular training to respond to onboard emergencies.